Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming to you with the first episode of State of Decay 2. Man, it's been a long time since I said the first episode of anything. <laughs> but here it is. The first episode of State of Decay 2. I'm excited as fuck. Um, I have seen a little bit of the starting area, mainly because I couldn't stop myself. I needed to know. <laughs> so, uh, there goes my headset again. There it goes. <laughs> Great fucking start to this episode. Alright, uh, I had to look into it. I needed to know what was going on, and I know basically how the setup starts. Uh, I know where it's going to be going from there, so I'm going to hope that uh, it just stays that way, because otherwise I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> because, I, I, you know, we've already played the first state of decay we have a basic idea of what's going on but then there's also the case that we might not continue to know what's going on <laughs> so we just uh roll with it as best we can so we're going to continue well continue we're going to continue on rather by starting a new community and we get our setup at this point. Afraid of the dark, you can light up your entire base by building a generator facility or by claiming a power outpost. A power outpost? That's the first I'm hearing of this. Hmm. Then again, I've been kind of keeping myself relatively in the dark <laughs> on some things. Mainly because I want, like, the time that I come upon these things to be a surprise. Okay. Alrighty, the Surly Siblings. Months after the apocalypse, you reunited with your estranged brother. Since then, the two of you have stayed one step ahead of the zombies and starvation, but now supplies are running low. Luckily, your brother learned of an army-run refugee camp where you hope to find food and shelter. Just as long as you remember to share like Mama taught you. Well, here's hoping. Assistant Principal Immor Immortal Immortal Immortal? <laughs> um Hmm I'm not sure what that means. Okay, we got jury rigger, football fan, cashier. Alright. Alright. That's one. Alright, that's an that's an option. Old buddies. Steven and Bob, all right? You've been bailing your oldest friend out of trouble since middle school, and even though you're reasonably certain he did not cause the apocalypse, <laughs> he hasn't exactly been helpful since it started. Luckily, an army refugee camp up ahead offers the promise of safety and a hot meal. The clock is ticking for your old pal to mess it up. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. That's a little rude, but that's fair. <laughs> Okay. Confident high metabolism action movie extra. That that gives you some setup, that's for sure. Although apparently not enough for cardio wits and fighting. Mainly shooting. Alright. Well Bob seems to uh, know a lot more in that department. Holy shit. Factory worker prefers the sidelines. Decent shot. But clearly. <laughs> clearly. Alrighty, well, there's that. Perpetual breakup. Ah, the gays. Ah, uh, <laughs> this, this was uh, the one I saw setting up. Their interactions are semi-adorable. Because <laughs> I know people like that. Uh, you and your girlfriend have dated and split up at least ten times over the years, but no matter how bad the breakup is, you always manage to rekindle the spark. Things were going really well until the zombies took over. As you approach an army refugee camp in search of food, you are back together. At least, till the first argument. <laughs> That's fair. Hall monitor and spry. Okay. And, uh, made science videos and hesitant. Hmm. Alright. Alrighty. Annabelle's pretty good with her wits. That, that's not very good with her fighting and shooting, but... Very good with cardio and wits. 
And that'll end up being a plus. And then the odd couple. David Conway and Don Mason. Blade collector live by a code and organized. Let me guess. David was a weeb. <laughs> I'm just going to guess that David was a weeb. I have nothing other than my own experience to tell me this. But I'm gonna say that. <laughs> Okay, if not for zombies, you would have never found love. The two of you met in the woods, survivors from different worlds, with no homes to go back to. Oh god, this sounds like a fucking rom-com. Ugh. <laughs> Though your roads might never have crossed, you are now inseparable. As you approach an army refugee camp, you hope the same apocalypse that brought you together doesn't tear you apart. Well, here's hoping. Alright, he's good with fighting, and he's good with his wits. Cardio and shooting is lacking, but I can work with that. Don Mason used to sell fertilizer. I, and was a hiker. Very good with cardio, pretty much making up for David's uh, lack of ability in that department. And she's good with gardening. I can live with that. I can live with that. I'm going to go with that. Wow, that was a fast load. Oh, jeez. This is so more in-depth with the graphics than it used to be in the old one. Shit, I love shit, it. Shit. Yeah, that's a proper response. Whoa. That's a super close-up of Zambambo. Let's go, let's go. Yep. Whoa, okay. Okay. That's not gonna hold forever. Whoa. Check this shit out. The Muertos got no skin. We need to go, like now. That gate won't last long. I... I told you we were better off on our own. I'm sorry, did he just say muertos? Right. The woods were way better than an army base stocked with food. You, you've, you've got a point, Don, but... I mean, did you stop with the sassiness? Okay. What the... What, what, the, what the button for the instant kill now? How'd they get inside? Maybe that's why there's nobody here. That's a good point. What the hell? Where'd everybody go? Uh, Looks like they left in a hurry, too. Or they're now dead and roaming the area. Okay, well, the bat's already busted. I can see that much. Well, on the way to busted. Huh. Well, balls. <laughs> that kind of fucks it up. Uh, also, I noticed it. he just called them muertos. Which, uh... I mean, Spanish, awesome. But also, at the same hand, was uh, used in The Walking Dead, uh, the, the newest one, wasn't it? Like the side story of uh, Telltale Games? Um, am I the only one who noticed that? Then again, I'm probably one of the few people who picked this couple. <laughs> so that might be the only reason I know. Alright. Uh, and you. Okay. Ooh, bandage. Bandage is nice. Bandage is good to have in the back pocket. Oh, whoa. What? Okay. Oh, running button. That's what it is. Oh, okay. Alright. Your bat bro. You always carry a short backup weapon. That's probably a good thing. Is that what the, uh... Is that what the, uh, later half of, uh... State of Decay break taught me because that I, if I recall correctly, um, <laughs> if I recall correctly, like it's fucking some big conspiracy or something, um, I remember it being oh pockets, oh nice, that's how you you can always see what the next item in the pockets are, cool, um, yeah, well bat's gone now. 
can, uh, I'm, I'm trying to process my thoughts. Uh, it's early in the morning. <laughs> so, if I remember correctly, State of Decay 1 had, eventually, the, uh, knife that you could use if, you know, shit got bad. Uh, at least with Hudson, that was a thing. I never really found that out with anyone else because I didn't trust, you know, anyone else to survive when that sort of shit happened, especially in the higher breakdown levels. But, that was a thing, so I guess that's what we have available to us. Ooh. Fuck. Well, that's not gonna be good. Let's bandage us up, and... Whoop! Bring the brew, haha! <laughs> Caused a commotion while recklessly searching a container. Well, thank you! Thank you, State of Decay 2. Fuck you too, I guess. <laughs> Criticize my way of playing. <laughs> to be fair, it wasn't really a good idea. And... Hey! Bandage! Which means the ones I used was free. Okay. So. You can go slow, or if you're pressing down, it'll make you go forward. Okay. That's good. Huh. And this is the aiming reticle. Still works the same way it used to. I've been hearing that the gunplay is supposed to be improved in this version, so I'm hoping it works out that way. Ooh, that was brutal, and I like it. Is that a screwdriver? That looks like a screwdriver. I mean, that's good in a pinch, so I mean, uh, that's... That's realistic. <laughs> Alright. This is officially the shittiest refugee camp I've ever seen. <laughs> no, keep it together. Bruh? She's got a point. You need to calm down. David, she has a point. Alright. Okay. Let's just go through this toolbox here. Maybe we find something good. Ooh. Tire iron. Melee weapon blunt. Oh, and it, ha and it has all the stats fucking, you know, spelled out for you instead of it being just vague symbols. That's that's great. That's that's definitely an upgrade from State of Decay 1. Some people didn't know what the fuck they were looking at. And uh, eventually, some of us figured it out on our own. Um, <laughs> I figured it out on my own. Um, then I, you know, found other people um, through the forums and then they mentioned it to me. You were right, pretty much. Alright, this lightweight bludgeon, <laughs> I couldn't fucking say the word bludgeon for some reason, is as good at cracking skulls as it is at fixing tires. Maybe better, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's probably true. Que bueno. <laughs> que bueno. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit, my Spanish is so bad. I need to fucking... Ooh, you can pick up broken... Ooh. Okay. Alrighty. I can repair the wooden bat. Question is, do I want to? I don't know. Ooh, components. So there is a repair. Repair mechanic. So you can at least keep your favorite weapons instead of, oh, it broke, it's gone forever, fuck you. That's actually fucking great. I like that. That is fucking awesome. All right. All righty. That is beautiful. No retreat. No surrender. Hey, check out these notes. You know, I'd write one for you if you got lost. Oh. Am I the one who's going to get lost? <laughs> Okay, you can write one for me then. Damn. David. Whatever. Thanks for fantasizing about me going MIA. Let's just keep moving. <laughs> David, way to stick your foot halfway into your mouth there, bub. <laughs> Good fucking job. Alright. There we go. Note from Searcher's Wall. The retreat is wrong. We took an oath to 
to protect these people. We cannot abandon them in their hour of need. Join our cause. Save our nation. We are Red Talon. Red Talon. That sounds like a name I'm going to have to remember. In fact, I'm fairly sure that that's a name I'm going to have to remember. There's no way that they could just drop a name like that and it not mean anything. Especially this time around. Beautiful. But, jeez, my headset is kicking out and back in. It's a little annoying. I thought I had it figured out. Apparently I did not. Oh boy. That's a lot of Zimby Zambros. Okay. God, I wish I had a gun right now. Alright, and the headset's kicking back off. Gotta wait for it to come back. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, man. At least it gives me time to fucking focus on my thoughts. There it goes. Cool. Audio's back. Alright, so... A lot of things have changed. A lot of things are better. Um, I'm going to have to figure out how to do the murder mechanics <laughs> real quick because I don't want to keep breaking my weapons the way I did with the bat. Um, I thought I knew what they were, but apparently the button presses I'm used to were not right. Or maybe they were just looser in the first game and they're very tight as of now. I don't know. So we'll find out. Fuck you. Fuck. Whoop, okay. Fuck you. Fuck you. Jesus. Come on. Take your lumps. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, your head was caved in some good. Fuck you. Ooh. Ooh. That looked like it hurt. <laughs> okay, give me a second. I need to figure out what's up with my headset. Okay, I think I figured out what was wrong with it now, because where I'm at now makes it less likely to kick off. Maybe I moved a little bit during that entire time, and it just made it want to kick off more and more. I don't know. Huh. There's that. Perfect. I don't honestly think I want the bat all that much. Toothpaste pinatas. You've searched ten containers. Alrighty. That is fair. That's a weird way to call it, but that's fair. Alright, um... What the... Can I not get into my fucking inventory now? I... Did the buttons change on me again? There it is, okay. I, I decided I wanted to get rid of the bats, so... That's not what I wanted. I wanted to drop it. Okay, that was the button. I was hitting the wrong button. Okay. Because the bat does not seem as good compared to the tire iron. So I'm going to keep the tire iron. No retreat. Coward. Well. And the bash. What the hell is this place? The last stand for bureaucracy? <laughs> yeah. That's what it looks like. It sounds like. There's my flashlight. Oh, it's a lot weaker than it was in the first game. Well, I mean, at least, hey, it's showing on the person. That's good enough. Instead of just being like a random light source out of nowhere. It's like a magical light bulb. No, it's actually something. That's nice. All right. Shut tight. Yeah, for now. Uh, whoop! Oh, 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 shit, fuck, what the fuck am I, am I just absolutely worthless, come on, He's Jesus, just like that muerto we saw outside the gate, ah, damn it, it bit me, I hate that, well, I'm sure you do, we both had worse, well, that's true, don't be so flippant, don't be so flippant, that thing looked weird, that looked weird, man, I know what's going on, but they don't know. They don't seem to know. Oh. 
Oh, these. These people have been dead for a long time. Oh, it must smell awful in here. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. I'm going to take this slow. Because I don't want to fuck things up. Okay. Camp Osprey guidelines. No fires, vandalism, or unruly behavior. No loud noises after sundown. All the unauthorized supplies will be confiscated. No use of facilities on non-designated hygiene days. Okay, there had to be designated hygiene days? Okay, that's fair. Uh, remain within your signed habitation sector. Evacuees may not leave camp without authorization from the civilian control office. Report any illness or death immediately. That's fair. I'll keep that there. I don't really need to carry that on my person. This bite is really itching. I'm sorry. I'll be faster next time. Yeah, hopefully I will be. It seemed like I was just sitting there missing the entire Make time. I felt like an idiot. The fuck is all this? Oh, shiza. Holy fuck. They are very dead. Okay. Uh, oh, so that's what the button is. Okay. That's what my problem was. I was hitting the wrong button. Okay. Alrighty. That shit is nasty. Yeah, it is. <laughs> to be fair, I mean, you're knocking their head off. It's going to be a little nasty. Alright. So now I know what the button press was. It was absolutely different from what it used to be. Okay. I feel like I'm burning up. Seriously, this is bad. Yeah. I'm out of meds, but I'll find you something. Don't worry. Yeah, we'll we'll get we'll get to it. We won't let this couple die. No way. <laughs> Hello. Bladed weapon. Durability takes a hit, knockdown takes a hit, but dismember, lethality, quietness, speed is Qué all bueno. up there. Que bueno. Okay. Whoa, something over here. First aid. Oh. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Oh. This is useful, but I won't do anything for that fever. Yeah, that's true. Shit. Alright, I was hoping. I was hoping that eventually we'd get into a position. Okay, can we just leave this party? Apparently not. We can make it. Just keep quiet. Yeah. Just be very, very quiet. Hold it for stealth. All right. And okay. Stealth finishes zombie. Got to get real close. Okay. And you're gone. Thank you for cooperating with your death. Alright, we're doing good. And whoop. Good shit. You dead. Oh good. Oh boy. Oh no. And it's staring right at me. This is unavoidable, isn't it? This is what's supposed to teach the newer players about. Screamers, isn't it? Ah, uh, fuck. It's not going to turn around, is it? Son of a bitch. Ah, fuck. I was hoping I would be able to catch it while his head was turning. Son of a bitch. Get to the ladder. Alrighty. All right, working on it. Okay, okay, up we go. Beautiful. Here we are. You Wait, were. What are you doing here? The last evac trucks left days ago. Well, my girl heard the army ran these camps. Where is everybody? Why do you have to phrase it, my girl? Camps down and move on. She's her own girl. No more army, my She's man. Just with you. Not here. Just a few of us, dumb enough to stay behind. Dumb Only enough. Only me and the doc survive. Okay, not an exaggeration. 
My brain is on fire. Oh, shit. Tell me what bit her. Was this real nasty fucker? All covered in blood? What's wrong? This is bad. Real bad. You need serious help. Yeah, they they know what's going on. Doc I knew still what was be going down on. at the SNB. SNB. Okay. Tell well, her well. tell her. Oh, it's a she. Okay, that's cool. All right, the one I saw before. Uh, I was watching Ray Narvaez's stream. Uh, what I saw with them was the uh, soldier was a woman and the doctor was a man. So I guess it's inverted this time around. That's fine. That's fine. That is just fine. What the? Sounds like there's Zambambos down here, too. Fine Cho, the doctor at the Swine and Bovine Restaurant. Okay. Well, at least they're outside the gate. We bobster Awesome. That's still a mechanic. Good beans. Except it's less automatic now. Alright, here we are. Where did you two come from? I thought civilians had been gone for days. Most have. We were kind of in the area, heading here. Uh, Still trying to be. Yeah. Your friend bitten? Yeah. That's my girl. Who was a zombie with blood on the outside. Why do you keep saying my girl? I'm so sorry. You should come David. with me. David, pendejo. Can you, can, you, can you stop being possessive? Oh, God. That's what bit me, one of those things. It's called blood plague. It's very contagious, and it doesn't take long to do its job. No, it does not. That's going to happen to me? Not as long as I'm around. Hey, I could use your help. Do ya? All take right. a flashlight, go in there and look for a sample case. I need you to bring it to me. Okay. Uh, sample case is in... Before I lost my team, we were learning all we could about blood plague. We developed a cure, but it only works if you use it soon after infection. All right. The army took our lab when they left. Uh, of but they course. didn't get everything. Well, here's hoping. All right. Plague samples. Disgusting sample of tissue from a plague, a plague, plague inflicted zombie or plague heart. Required to craft blood plague cure in your infirmary. So you can craft a cure. Awesome. Give Joe what you found. Can do. Did you find it? Uh, I didn't find any medicine, but I found that. No cure? Not good. I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc, All it's right. checkout time. Fucking Zeds are swarming the perimeter. Plague zombies, too. I know Shit. you want to save Amari, but it's not for us to bounce. This is Amari? Amari's the reason we have a treatment. Exactly. Don't let that legacy die here. Other survivors are going to need your help. Like her. That's a fair point. Okay, but I can't just leave. Not like this. Do what you need to, but make it fast. I'm sorry to ask this, but I need your help. Okay. I'm going to save your girlfriend if I can. Well, thank you. Because no one deserves what happened to Amari. And I assume but Amari's right here. I don't right have here. the strength to end things. That's fair. I'll take it. And we get equipped... A new weapon. A PPK. I'm okay with a PPK. Perdon me. May God watch over you. Alrighty, let's get moving. I know I have a hard time letting people take care of me. For what it's worth, I'm glad we're together. Don't worry. I ain't doing the apocalypse without you. Okay, that's kind of cute. All right, let's get moving. Thank you for doing what I couldn't. We gotta I understand. decide something before we go. Do it. Oh, this is where you set up where you're gonna be going. Okay. All right, all right, cool. We need a, we need to find a place to settle down. Uh, the foothills, town on the plateau, town in the valley. The valley uh, should put us back in Trumbull Valley if I'm reading this correctly. Um. I'm not sure if I want to go back, honestly. Um, huh. Well, let's let's just take a trip down memory lane. 
Oh yeah, that's cool, Leo. I'm that, riding shotgun. Taken. I hope your driving is good. Well, okay. I I can do that. You probably have the better gun for shooting out the side anyway. You uh, ended up not taking shotgun there, but <laughs> you uh, ended up lying to me. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, it's no whatever. more army, huh? So oh, no control. How do we okay. survive now? Hey, come on. As long as we're together, we can make it through anything. Oh, David, that's so romantic and cheesy as fuck. <laughs> but it's cool. It's cool. I like it. I like it. All right. I like this couple. I like this couple. They're pretty cool. Alrighty, and here we are, out of the tutorial area, into the town proper. Uh-oh. <laughs> I was hoping it didn't freeze there, because the music stopped suddenly on top of the screen's uh, little loading indicator. I was sitting there going, oh shit. Worst time for a crash ever. <laughs> Alright, well... Muzzle brakes reduce recoil and increase the destructive power of your shots while also making them louder. Yeah, that sounds about right. Unjamming a firearm with a weapon handling skill is only temporary. Once you have a workshop, you can make long-term repairs. Every vehicle has an inventory you can access from the back. Okay. There is a lot more in-depth to this than I thought. <laughs> Shit. I'm gonna need to work on that well damn we're out of gas guess we better start scavenging yep i'm gonna have to more fuel won't help us now well that might be the, the way case. that blood plague is progressing your friend won't last long without a place to rest that's a good point oh, i have literally never felt worse in my life i'm sure we have to find a place to settle down now okay we can do that. Once the army and I agree, it's time to get off the road and find a home. Do you just call him the army? Is that what you do? Some place we can build what we need to keep your friend from dying. So we need to get a base. Is what you're saying? All right, we'll work on that. Uh, we're gonna keep it offline for now. I All saw right. a decent home site right before we ran out of gas. Yeah. Sounds like a plan. We shouldn't stay out here for long. That is true. All Gotta right. Be careful. Catching the plague would really cramp my style. Yeah, I bet. I bet. All right, let's get moving. Get moving on that. Um, base is over here. Okay. Let's uh get moving on that. Oh boy. Sam Bambos and skirts. Didn't expect to see that. Okay. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. We got more than a couple. Oh, fighting going up. Nice. Awesome sauce. All right, let's let's get moving over here, shall we? Oh, jeez, it's farther away than I thought. Oh man. Ah, jeez. Okay. From behind. Huh? Well, I guess I gotta go around this fuck, don't I? Alrighty. And here we go. <laughs> Beautiful. Alright, ooh. Wait a second, that car looks usable. Ish. <laughs> Never mind. Holy shit, this thing looks broken. Need a gas can? Oh, it does have gas, though. Um. Go claim that's. Okay. Okay. Lead the way. Alright, let's keep moving. Zombie over there. Yeah, it is. Can't do it. Oh, okay, that's. Oh, throw. Grab zombie. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Okay, that didn't work out. I'm just gonna kill it. Kill it. There we go. Guess that's gonna have to be how that works. Alright. 
Let's uh, not attract attention this early on. And just run over there, huh? Sprinting actually doesn't take as much as stamina as it used to. That's nice. Or maybe it does and it just... Nostalgia for the original is coloring my vision on that. Nostalgia. David is increased in standing. Yay! Alright, here we are. There's no way I'm going to be getting up that thing. Alright. This looks... Well, not great, but... Survivor has blood plague, food stockpile low, establish an outpost. Welcome home. Is this what we call home? Explore your base and interact with facilities to see what they do. I can do that. Alrighty. Cool. Alright. Well, I mean... Oh. Supply locker. Hey! Round for my gun. Got coffee. Uh, weak painkillers. Wooden bat. Okay. Cool beans. And I can drop some of my stuff in there. That's fine. Uh, let's store that. Um, store that. Store that. Okay. Okay. Small backpack. All right. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good at this point. Although, I'm not entirely sure how much more time I can devote to this. Because I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. Um, let's go to base. Oh! Oh, hey! Hey! Show details. Okay. Depressed? Well, I mean, you have blood plague, girl. <laughs> I can understand why. Alright. And I can select someone to take control from here. Parker Rollins. Okay. Now I know your name, Parker. Stable. Well, active duty military, young, hard as nails. Well, I mean, I would hope so. Alright, we got Elizabeth Cho. Alright. Camp physician, unmotivated germaphobe. I know a couple of those. Uh, <laughs> David Conway. All right. Good. All right, let's uh, work on the base now, shall we? Command center. Built in. I don't have enough to upgrade that. I can't, I can't do anything? Son of a bitch. All right. Outpost one. Oh, man. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. I feel like I can't get out of here without uh, getting the Yo, blood so plague of these things. ghost could come from the same body? How weird would that shit be? Are you... Are you talking about heartless and nobodies from Kingdom Hearts? Is that what you're doing right now? Because that's a concept with that. So, um, <laughs> I don't know what to think. Okay. Okay. And here we go. And whoop. Or you can talk to them in person. I wasn't even paying attention to what they were saying. What? Um. I'll be right behind. Didn't we claim it technically already? I thought we claimed it. I guess we didn't. All right, well. Probably run back to it and figure out what I'm doing. Hey, at least I built up some cardio. <laughs> That's good. All right. Use command center. Awesome. Okay. So. I have no idea what I'm doing still. So, we've claimed it. Inviting other survivors to accompany you on your scavenger run improves your chances of survival. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm already at the spot, though. Already claimed it. Uh, okay, cool. All right, and... Back up. 
Um, no fatigue recovery rate. Four beds short. That's fair. Um, passive noise from population. Ah, uh, boy, I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. Find plague hearts. Okay. Cho unmotivated. Okay. Okay. Interact with each of the facilities. Find out what Yo, they do. one of these days we gotta throw a party, like like a rager. Just I found a couple of things while I was out scavenging. Oh hey. That's something. Thank you for that. Alright, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I still have no idea what I'm doing. Grab the location marked on your map to look into it as a potential home. Did I not just do that? Did I not just do that? I thought I did. Okay, well. Wait. That's what it was. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I went to the wrong fucking spot. I'm a dumbass. Alright. Okay. Alright, and... There we go. Ooh. Rody. Alright. I'm just gonna run it. I'm just gonna run it. Uh oh. Alright, well. You're gonna be chasing me for a little bit. Aren't ya? That's fair. Alright, you know what? I'll just head straight on. Fuck you. Ooh, that does it. Nice job, Parker. Fuck yeah. I didn't even need to finish it. <laughs> yeah, you're young, alright, Parker. <laughs> Fucking goofy one-liners to boot. Fuck yeah. I have a feeling Parker's younger than me, and I'm 26. I'm closer to 30 than I've ever been. Okay. Okay. Oh. okay. Fuck you, guy. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna use a bandage. Cool. Should be fine now. Hey, that site could have base potential. That is true. Once we clear out the zombies, we can get a closer look. That is true. Hey, well, thank you for that. I guess that's a vote of confidence. Okay, well, fuck you, fuck you, take your lumps, and we're good. Alright. Bullets are the only cure. That's false. That's false, because we have an actual... Locked up. We have a possibility. Oh, you know someone heard that. You knew something heard that. You know it. Don't even try that. Oh, fuck. Okay, come on. Oh, fuck off. There we go. Oh, so the dodge mechanic does still work. Holy shit, that was a nice decapitation. Perfect. Fuck you. There we go. Perfect. Alright, let's get in here. Securing a building. Alright, so we gotta secure it. How many times do you think people have lived here? Don't think about that shit. It'll just fuck you up. Yeah, that's, that's the last thing you need to think about. I mean, you can probably uh, try and guesstimate how many people lived here before the plagues and, you know, Zambambos as opposed to after. That I don't think will fuck you up too much. Maybe that's just me. <laughs> Maybe that's just my thinking on it. Let's fly over this and finish you. You must enter every room and kill every zombie on the property. Well, I can do that. To track your progress, huh? Anything in here? No, it doesn't look it. Alright. Figured I'd check. Alright, so we're down here. Okay. Oh, there you are. Yeah, there you go. Well, I mean... You what? You saw a what? Son of a bitch. 
Please tell me you were joking with me. Please tell me you were kidding me. Oh, no. That's not what I need right now. Okay, we've cleared it. Good to me. Time to stake our claim and move in before someone else shows up. That is true. All right, home site can be claimed. Where is... Hey, Doc. We found a spot that should work well as our new home base. Nice work. Once you claim the site, my patient and I will meet you there. Alrighty. Okay, we got to claim it here. Total slots. Alright, cool. Claim home site and confirm. I guess the other one was the home site we already had before. Uh, so now we're good. Alrighty. Hey! Settled our community in the valley tel te tel tel territory. Okay. Cool beans. Alright, so we're all good here. The wooden bat. All the good stuff. All the good stuff. Grab one of those. Alright. Survivor has blood plague. Food stockpile low. Clear debris from home. That's fair. I talked to Cho about how to save Dawn. All right. I guess I got to talk to her, who is right over here. In here. Okay. That's where she's at. Cool. No? Was I wrong on that? I guess I must have been wrong. Where is she at then? Shit. Fuck it. She must be down here. Too fucking loud. Well, yeah, but... At least it got you through the door. Alright. I have no idea where I'm going. <laughs> I'm so lost in this house. It's a big problem with two... Uh, two level houses. I have no idea where I'm going. Alright. Well, where's Cho, then? Where's Elizabeth? Build facility. Um, resource production, morale and training, defense and utilities. I mean... Rain collector could work. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, that's probably a good idea. Isn't it? I don't know. Alright. And here she is. Okay, cool. I was wondering where the fuck you were. You were just, like, not in the world for a moment there. Without an infirmary, we'll lose Dawn to Blood Plague. Can you survey the area for building materials? I saw a cell tower nearby that should give you a good view. Good All right. Be safe. I'm gonna need it. Okay, materials depleted. Oopsie doodle. Probably shouldn't have made that ring collector. Okay, I'm just gonna end the episode here for right now. Um, I have very little time. And I need to get moving as soon as possible. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. And there will be a next episode. I'm just hoping I'll have this settled uh, before I get the next episode started. <laughs> Someone let me know um, uh, if everything is essentially the same as it used to be. So, this has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and getting this fucking couple started. And hopefully we're not going to lose Dawn by the next episode because I um, am not sure how the working over time part will go with this new game. And I don't know if I'll be able to f get her uh, cured before the next episode for you. <laughs>